All right, well, let's do some Animal Crossing if you're watching this later on YouTube. Thanks for clicking. And yeah, I hope you've been enjoying. It is Saturday morning and I'm up. Not that early, but... Yeah. It's another one of those rainy days, so... Like, well... I'm actually caught, caught up on adult responsibilities, so... I'm just gonna chill. Coffee might take a little bit to kick in. I don't know if I have like my morning voice, but <laughs> if you hear a difference, that might might be it. Yeah. Oh, I'll have to remember to do that later myself. I've been told that like in the morning my voice is a little deeper. <laughs> I don't know. Whenever I used to go out and uh, hang out with friends and then have work the next day, there's always a case someone would say, well, what's with the voice, man? Well, what do you mean? Oh, cool. Hey, look at that. Finally. It's also raining, so that kind of... Well, I... Oh, well. I only took two months. That's hybrid red. So that's good. So... Well, maybe? It should be. Put it here. It's alright, it'll... My voice is weird, it'll vanish in like, I don't know, half an hour. Why is it when it's raining in-game, it's actually raining outside? This happened last weekend as well. Yes! <laughs> we got blue. Okay, I need to look at the chart. Madness might be over soon. I mean, it sucks about the roses, but it's okay. Ah, disappointment. I'm still going to take them and plant them somewhere. Just to give more odds. Take both with me. This is the only remaining one for the tulips. I know it does a black one's disregard.
what are the odds that this is something good? Well... Okay, more blue ones. Yeah... No, that's not it. I got excited, I was like, oh wait, is that it? No, I've already got that one. But that's okay, I got other ones, so that's fine. Bread, yeah. I think I can just plant this one in the big garden now. if it'll grow. We'll see. Just need to do some swaps. any luck because I think these are basically done let me look at the chart uh flowers I need to take the blues and mix them with pink to get hybrid red which that's this will work if I get red here. Yeah, yeah hang on. Okay, this will work. Oh man. <laughs> you know, every year uh, I'm playing a game or doing something that is a lengthy or difficult or tedious process, and I feel like. So this is a chill game. This is probably this year's lengthy thing. I don't think I've done anything too hard this year. I'm trying to think what would be the the game that was difficult this year. I'm playing Risk of Rain, but I'm not hitting my head against that brick wall like usual. It's more casual. I have to go through my game list. Like, it's been a big year. I mean... I struggled with Donkey Kong Country too, but... It's not like... That took long. Yeah, I guess this is probably... The thing... The stubborn thing this year, I guess. Hmm. Oh, that's nice. I'll get a couple of these, put them indoors. Yeah, maybe one more. One more. What? No. 140,000 for that? Uh uh. There's probably some significance to that.
I don't know. I think I'm gonna be boring. Um. <laughs> Spangle shorts. Yeah, that doesn't work. That's fine. It's a lot of pockets. Alright, let me have a look at what I bought overnight. I think these can just go, I don't need to customize them. Digi torch stacked fish containers, which I can't make. Because I don't have norm the normal one. Pockets on female clothes are right. I'm sure it exists. You know, there's an idea for someone wanting to start a business, just like create a bunch of clothing that has pockets. <laughs> someone would have had to have done it. Like that would be a challenge, make clothing that has pockets, but then also doesn't sacrifice looks, right? Or, I don't know, perceived look. I find that just insane, it's just... What do you mean, pockets are rare? I don't see as many people carrying purses. I think that's kind of becoming less of a thing now. How's it going, Nick, though, anyway? Stool. Gyro it out. This one's happy that they have a sandwich. It's okay. You try to stuff everything in your jacket pockets. Only problem then is if it's too hot to wear, you have to bring it around. Oh yeah. Can't say I've ever had any problems like that. How's this gonna work? Yeah, I guess put it here. I need to get fancy drinks. I know there's fancy drinks in the game, I just need them. But now that'll do. Stop looking at this.
someone sitting by themselves. <laughs> That's a lot of food. What, it's like sandwich soup being stood up. I don't think they're stood up. They're just enjoying food on their own. You never gone to a place and just sat down and ate by yourself? Never? Really? Just try it. You're out and about, you sit down, you eat. You have your headphones on and you just listen or if you have your phone watch stuff and you just chill and eat. I mean if you go to a cafe it's not uncommon. Sometimes people bring their laptop and they'll get a little work done or do something. go to go haircut not all the time like depends where i go but this place there's a pretty good noodle restaurant it's the best way i can describe it but i'll get the haircut and then i'll go sit down and eat at this noodle place and it's just me I, I can't remember, honestly, if I have one of these. I'll grab it anyway. I think there are certain places where you wouldn't do it. It's more like the fence, fancy kind of... Well, I wouldn't say fancy, but like sit-down restaurants where... You know, the vibe in there is basically you're either going there with a family or you're like on a date or something. Like, I don't know if I would go to a steakhouse and sit down by myself. But other things, like, yeah, it's fine. Don't really go out to eat a lot. That's probably for the best. I think it's nice to do. Just one to get out, but also it's just... As long as it's not junk. It's... It can be... Okay. They did start to deliver here from an Indian place and it's been great. Oh boy. I don't mind Indian food, it's alright. But it's like on on my tier of foods that I'm like in the mood for, it's it rates lower. But I do enjoy it. There was a, some of it at the Christmas party yesterday. 
I grabbed these things. Um, I don't know what it was, but... Well, I know what it was. I don't know what it's called. That's better. But, you know, it, it looked like... I know you're going to laugh at me, but, like, it looked like chicken. Okay, so it's like... It was a fried ball, and it looked like just... A nugget of chicken. You know? Like, breast meat, then dipped in batter and then just fried that's what it looked like had the color had the texture and everything it was like oh this this looks like lemon chicken or something so i grabbed it and i'm happy with with my my pieces of supposed chicken i take a bite into it and it's cauliflower but here's the thing it did not taste like cauliflower it did not smell like cauliflower it was 100 percent cauliflower and the texture was different. It was, like, soft. It was good. It, it honestly didn't taste like cauliflower. Didn't taste like meat, but... It... Yeah. It was not what I was expecting. It was good. Do you like cauliflower? Uh, I like broccoli more than cauliflower. Ca cauliflower seems to have, like, this smell to it. I don't know how else to put it. It's like... There's a cauliflower smell. I know everything has a smell, but I mean... I don't want to say it smells old, but it, it just... It has this distinct smell. You'd be disappointed if you were expecting chicken, yeah. Well, they did have chicken wings, at least, but... I think that's part of the reason Indian food is, like, lower for me, is just... Um... There's a lot of vegetarian stuff. And though... I don't mind the curry stuff. Um... Sometimes it can be a bit much for my, my personal taste. It's like, I like it in small doses. I'm more of a fan of, like, Japanese curries or, like, Thai curries. They're a bit milder, and I don't mean, like, in how hot it is, it's more just how intense the flavor is. I know I made three holes, but I, I woke up like not even an hour ago, just... I've had some pretty good vegetarian food. That being said, it's like stuff that would not imagine that it would taste that good. What time is it? It's 1 a.m. Uh, it's 11 in the morning here. Pretty much how it is in game is exactly how it is outside. looking. Nah, here it's been alternating between rain, dry heat, humidity, and I just, I just want the weather to make up its mind and just get to summer. Like, I'll deal with the heat. 
just give me consistency. I said I got all three. It was a little rainy in the morning. Then during the day it was nice. It got warm. Pretty warm. Then it got disgustingly humid. Then at night time it started raining. So. And it carried over to now. when it's a thick white blanket over everything glittering in the moonlight. Do you live far away from, I guess, a main town or a city? Because that effect is probably enhanced if you live further out. Don't really get much of that here. It's just in the middle of the city, just light pollution. I did it again. I, I know. Three holes. I know. Used to. Will. Wait, which rock is it then? Place has town status, but it's technically a village. Gotcha. see the light from the city but you have lights or two yeah but i guess the, the amount of them would be less and so the sky is more prominent why did i not get that fossil I did make a small coffee, to be fair. Because it was raining, I didn't go to the place that I usually go to, and I just got stuff out of the cupboard. functionality of some of the stuff I've done. It's questionable at best. Like, the restaurants that don't have roofs, all their furniture, it's like... Just pretend that everything's fine, they don't get damaged, they're special books. Exactly. Or maybe they have like a protective sleeve. But I guess the sleeve would still get condensation. <laughs> Book condoms? What you, that's, why would you call it that? It's just the sleeve. a safe reading, I guess. Ugh, it's too early for me to be thinking about, like, just 
that sort of mental picture. <sighs> the smut usually happens at night. Fair enough. No, I mean, I'm not saying smart can't happen any other time of day. It's more of a... It's just in the context of the stream, it's like, I don't stream in the morning that often. So, it's like, these kind of conversations happen at night for me, typically. Instead of the bell. It shouldn't affect it too much, but... Ugh. I've said this so many times, but we have a lot of buttons on the controller, and yet they still insist on making one button do like 12 different things. And those things can clash with one another. I get it, it's like keeping the controls simple, but... Man, when when you do something you don't want to do. So there's one more furniture somewhere. Game, please. <laughs> I find a way in immediately. It takes me forever to get out. Golden flowers, I don't know, they don't look right. <laughs> Just... Get it, they're a novelty. I checked. Check these ones, yeah. So then... Oh, probably here.
There it is. Sea globe. Still no sign of that table. Ugh. I'm just making stretching sounds, it's fine. <laughs> Old man sounds like gas. I don't know what a blow with the sea. I guess I can see. Oh no, that's what is this? Oh, it's like it's it's almost like a uh, a snow globe. Yeah, it's a snow globe, but it's a sea globe. That's that's kind of nice looking. I've never seen this before. I don't know where I'd put it, but it's nice. I'm missing one fossil. chances whoops fossil I've probably walked past it a million times of how this turned out. This looks fine now. I don't know where this fossil is. I have three. <laughs> it's definitely one more. Okay, hang on. Should 
should probably bury this while I'm at it. Oh yeah, I need one more of these panels. gonna be somewhere overlooked, isn't it? It's just, there's no way it takes this long to find it. Okay. <laughs> there it is. I'll be glad once the fossil part of it is done, then I can not do it and just leave it. Is that not a permanent thing? What's not a permanent thing? Oh, the fossils keep turning up every day, but I can choose to ignore them at that point. You Six will... It's like, I think six is the cap that you can have, and then they stop turning up until you harvest the ones you have. So I can go... Can I just re rebury them? I don't know. Maybe not, but... I can just ignore it. Can you visit Friends Islands? Yeah. Social social aspect was big for us in 2020. There's not too much option to collaborate though together on an island, which is I guess it's the only downside to it. People get different stuff based off where you are when you make an account. So, it goes by hemisphere. You can pick if you want a southern or northern hemisphere one. It'll auto detect, but it'll last still. And then the island is like a random seed, so it'll be a particular layout. But people's day to day is is all random, so it's. You don't truly have the same island twice, ever. That's why when this game launched, my island was popular because... I had sharks, and no one else did. Well... Out of the viewers, that is, no one else did. Yeah, it's a fish, because my season started in summer, and everyone else started in winter. everything early because I had the summer stuff early and then I went to people's islands to get the other stuff so I, I got through the museum pretty quickly like I think within the first month I basically had all the fish with a couple of exceptions you can gift stuff too you can send each other letters through the mail and attach 
the present so you can send items. Or you can just drop stuff for people. The amount of... I got an Imperial bed pretty much right away. The amount of times someone came to my island was like, Hey, can you pick up and put down your Imperial bed so I can have it? Because that's how it works. It's like, as long as you have picked up the item once, then you can buy it for yourself in the catalog. So I had to pick up that bed, like, so many times. And just put it down as a normal item, and then... Yeah. That's alright. People did it for other stuff for me, so... Put that bed. Yeah, so they held it and then it registered to their, uh... Catalog. So then they can just buy it from their catalog. I do like that I've taken the slower this time, but I do miss this, that social aspect that was going on during that era. Hang on, I'm gonna turn on the lights. It's actually pretty dark in here, like it's daytime. There we go. That's better. I mean, there's light, it's just. Feels gloomy. Oh shit, I forgot to buy the art yesterday. Ah, just buy that one. <laughs> it didn't refresh today. Oh well. The art just... I don't know. It needs to show up more often in town. Even in my original island, I didn't get anywhere close to filling out the art part of the museum. You have to pretty much be here every day, buy the art, and hope that the one that he replaces it with is... is a real one. At least when the boat comes, there's... One that's real, usually. So. Oh, damn, it's the money one. Well, too late for that. I already got in all my money for the day from trees. Oh, well. Oh, I have nothing to customize. I'll buy that because I want to hang up more uh, music. 
Okay, so I need another counter. I think I used that one. Hey, Sandy. Uh, I'm doing alright, just... Chilling. It's kind of miserable outside, so... Yeah, I, I woke up, and... I look outside, and it's just, well... It's like how it is in-game, and... I'm up to date with all my responsible adult stuff, so... I'll kick back and chill. It is unusual timing. <laughs> Thank you for the 14 months, Kira. As if anything, this is kind of normal. If I was able to actually stream at this hour, it'd be fine. It's like, it's only, it's 11.30 in the morning here. I should probably go to the house and have a look. I think I need simple panels because I need to do the wall again. Oh no, I need another. Do I need another register? No, I think I got the registers covered. Simple panel. Should just buy it in the wood. Color. Alright, that'll do it. Character looks fancy. <laughs> it's because of all the pockets. It's the hair. Oh, the hair's been like that for ages. So, a lot of the time I'm wearing hats. So, counter, and then I need the wall again. I think it'll fit. It's a bit of a tight squeeze, but that's fine. Hats aren't fancy unless it's a top hat or fedora. Top hat, hat, fedora is like debatable. Some people hate fedoras. Can be seen as, fedoras can be seen as corny depending on who's wearing them. I did have a register. I need another register for downstairs. And then just hang up more album art. So whenever there's duplicates, I'll buy it. <laughs> this one's blowing bubbles on too, it's food. Okay. Well. Maybe it's hot and it's just blowing bubbles to cool down the food. I don't know. Oh, and I need to get more gnomes. Did I steal the star from the castle on Beauty and the Beast? 
I don't have a candle. If you see an animate candle, maybe. I need more gnomes to act as security in the venue. in here. I feel like maybe hanging some plants or something might be the way. Unless there's like a, a hand dryer. That's probably the only thing. <laughs> uh, this makes me laugh. Well, the, the especially just the arm movements and the squeaking sounds, that, that's funny. done that on an island just have I'm sure they have a bathroom I don't think anyone's gone to the effort of making it look like a gyro it's taking a leak gotta, gotta be pretty original in that regard Never seen one with a TV over the pisser. Well, I've definitely seen the TV over the urinal thing. That's like, that's a reference to Yakuza, the minigame. It's where I got the idea from. <laughs> Do I have that? I feel like I have that. Hang on. Yeah, okay. Just checking. Don't you like need to see where you pee? Not on a not on a urinal. Because there's a wall that it goes down and then it just goes down the drain anyway. I mean unless you can't control your stream and it's going sideways, maybe. Cuz you look at you look at the design of it. If you had to pee into a normal toilet, then yeah, you would need to pay attention. But with this, as long as the stream is straight ahead, it's fine. That was a good question, you had no clue. Well, uh, yeah, just, just look at the functionality. It's like, they're generally pretty tall or up high, and it's just... It's like, the, it's, think of it as basketball. It's like, you can go for a swish and watch what you're doing, or you just go off the backboard. Yeah, there you go. Who says men can't multitask? We can take a piss and watch stuff on a TV. And we don't fall behind on what's happening with the big game. I don't know. Thank you. 
Tastes good. I need to find who is making stuff today. I feel like I've talked to Julia already, but... I don't think having a TV in the bathroom is, like, a great idea anyway. I think in general that's probably not going to work out. But that being said, I imagine one day it would be more of a reality. Not for watching TV, just all advertisement stuff being digital and they just put screens in there to advertise while you take a leak. It's basically everywhere at this point. Toilets that sing songs, I'm sure putting a TV in a bathroom is not that much of a leap. A toilet that does what? Sing so well, it doesn't sing, it has music. You've never seen Japanese toilets, Nikto, or just heard the reputation of them? <laughs> they have all these buttons that have functions on them, it's funny. Buddy. <laughs> Casey falls over. Wait, so who's crafting? Gotta be one of the bottom two houses. Yeah, I haven't seen one of the fancy toilets that have a bunch of functions. And also have not seen a toilet with a wooden lid. It's just most of the ones here are just the white ones with plastic white lids. That's pretty much it. I always see ones that have wooden lids on TV or in games and stuff. Never seen one. It's just not really a thing here. Right, there we go. Yeah, sure. I don't know if I have that one.
Uh, actually, hold on. I'll do the Daily Island first. Because it's subsidized. I think I picked up the bottle for today. Yeah, looks like it. Time for a jolly spot of eggnog. I wouldn't know what that would taste like. It's another one of those things. I don't know. Do they have eggnog in Europe? It's not a thing here, I know that much. This might be another one of these things that's just purely American. It, I don't know, the name just doesn't sound appealing to me. <laughs> it's just... Egg... It just... It makes me think of something that just has a lot of egg in it. I don't know. It's just... But I got, I got the concept. It's, it's effectively like a custard. I don't know. What's worse, saying that you're drinking egg or drinking custard? I feel like drinking egg. It's a British origin? That's even more surprising. Well, given that we're one a British, ex-British colony. Well, I guess we're still a British colony. <laughs> but also just typically American straight away from British stuff. You have it there too, common for Christmas. Huh. I wonder what happened here. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe it is available. I'm sure it's available here. I just haven't heard of many people saying they have it. But that might also be... I mean, growing up, did not really have too many friends that were, quote, Aussies. Generally speaking, it was a lot of people that had immigrated to Australia, so it's like maybe just that alone may have been why I never came across it. I mean, I'm sure it's fine. It's like, I get it. It's sweet. I think it's just the name that puts me off more than anything else. Surely... A name without the word egg in it would sound more appealing. And does alcoholic um, eggnog, right? Like that just has rum in it. You also have glog, glog, glog. I don't know how to pronounce the O. It's more of a tradition. It's just mulled wine. But yeah, we're kind of boring. We don't really have anything. It's like, I think the Aussie thing is fruit mince pies, but I don't like them. And then it's just, well, since it's summer here, just barbecue. Fruit mints like apple pie. Yeah, kinda. I forget what fruits are in it, but it's, it's generally like spiced fruit.
And they're very tiny. They're very small. It's like typically an assortment of fruits and it's spiced. Oh, sounds like the eye and bird. Uh. So glug. <laughs> okay. I'm probably gonna forget, but good teacher. And that's not on you, the teacher. That's on me, the student. <laughs> Just not retaining stuff. That's just phonetics. Yeah, I think... I mean, Spanish is the same thing. We have letters that make different names. I mean, names. Sounds based on the accent thing on it. So, I understand the concept. I just don't know what sound it makes. But I'm sure if I used them often enough, I would be able to do it easy. The one thing, though, that I... It's languages that have, um like branching paths and words because of sound it's like cat was showing me this just how swedish people it's one word but then depending on how long they hold the end of the word it means something completely different and it's just like that's a fucking headache what do you do when you need to write something down do you just keep adding more letters to the end of it or, or do you have an actual sentence to use and then it's like, no, only when we talk, it's just, you know, we can't be bothered, so we just go, uh, 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 I, I'm exaggerating a little bit, but that's how it feels like to me. Swedish is easy, practically Norwegian. Try Slovakian. I have heard Slovakian before. Eastern European languages are hectic. I went to school with a bunch of people from Eastern Europe. They all sound the same. Don't tell them that. They'll they'll get angry. Oh, when they speak English, I was okay. I was gonna say. sound Scandinavian when you do too. Not really, no. And I've had experience with Norwegians. Um, when I went to university, there was like a dozen of them that were studying at my university as part of some program, so... I mean, uh, the accent does come out. It's just... But then again, I guess I don't have, like, a footing as to which one is, quote, like, the common one. But I'm just comparing it to, like, others I've come across that I feel like I've had thicker accents.
Oh, I can't make another axe because there's no branches here. Well, do these drop? I don't think these drop branches. Well, there's levels of Norglish. <laughs> it's, cer it's certain words that you you hear it more with. It's like, um, like CH, for example. I, I find words that have CH, you can hear it. Or uh, sometimes the letter O will do it as well. It's because of phonetics, yeah. It's honestly the same with, uh, Spanish. A variety called ponche crema has been made and consumed in Venezuela and Trinidad. Yeah, but that's, like, further south. <laughs> Nowhere near where my parents grew up. It's, it's one of those things that, like, there's a lot of, um things when it comes to food that it's like multiple cultures discover and they've never interacted with one another or at least at that point in time didn't Sounds like an American thing. Well, the word, yes. Like, Venezuelans don't drink eggnog. They drink a word which is like something cream. I don't know what ponche means, but it's probably slang. And that to me sounds more appealing than eggnog. Oh yeah, drink some eggs! Versus drink some cream. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Pop rocks. Uh, I don't generally open up my island because, to cut a long story short, Nintendo Switch Online doesn't work properly. I got that thing where like people can't connect to my island, and it's just I have to do a bunch of troubleshooting to get it working. So I don't want to derail the stream. I've tried to fix it, but it's just... It just doesn't work. The only time I can get people to connect to my island is if I take it out of the dock and go disable the Wi-Fi and tether to it with my phone, but that's just, like, a lot of messing around. I want to do some happy home stuff anyway, so I'll be leaving my island in a minute. Wait, what? I need a fishing rod. I was meant to make a an axe. 
keep doing that. I don't know, like even cream punch still sounds more appealing than eggnog. It's just, uh, I don't know, for me it's just because it has the word e egg in it, it just doesn't sound right. I, I know what it is. It's just the name, you know? Um, Ponche Crema is more of a liqueur. Well, they, that's, I guess, different. There's sometimes there are just things with name that just put me off trying them. It's like, in Southeast Asia, they have, um, desserts that use red bean. And, you know, they're, they're fine. It's just, I think it put it off. I put off trying them just because association with bean, it's like bean is savory and I'm like thinking, well, why do you want bean in your dessert? But it's good. The one that I can't bring myself to is this is a common thing in Indonesia is they have um, avocado smoothie. Which, it's just, I, I can't do it. You know, f for me, avocado is effectively like a mayonnaise substitute in some ways. It's just, you know, that's how I've had it always. So the way they do it is like, uh, and someone can correct me if I'm wrong, but it's avocado, then they mix it with a bunch of condensed milk, and then they add chocolate syrup to it and mix it. And they swear by it, it's just... Ah, uh, I don't know, man. <laughs> just... There's this mental barrier there that I just can't get past, you know? In my mind, I'm like, this should be had with nachos or something. It's just, nah. I can't bring myself to do it. Egg sounds gross. Well, drinking something that says eggnog, it's like, well, it's something that has egg. It's like, well, is, is this something that people that go to the gym try to drink to get more protein? It could be renamed. Like, I bet if I tried it, I could rename it to something better. It's like how I had, um, pumpkin spice. A pumpkin spice latte, because people kept asking. <laughs> so I had one. At Starbucks, just to get the damn authentic experience. And it's like, that is just the worst name ever for, for something. I'm sorry. It's like, it's just call it a cookie drink. It's, that's what it is. It tastes like a cookie less confusing. It's like, alright, I know what to expect. It's something that tastes like a cookie. Pumpkin spice? Oh, does it have pumpkin in it? Just no. Why do you call it pumpkin spice? Oh, because we associate it with fall. So why don't you call it fall spice? Oh, because pumpkins remind us of fall. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, man. All right, I'm going to a uh, happy home. Pumpkin seeds are delicious, yeah. And if it was a drink that had them? Nick, the pumpkin spice latte is basically, it tastes like a cookie that you would have probably during Christmas-ish period. And the latte was more of an ice drink. It wasn't like a, a coffee. 
It was alright, like... A bit too sweet for my liking. But I get it, it's like in summer, yeah, it'd go down well. But you know that there's something to it when... You go to a place that calls itself a coffee place and no one's buying coffee. Instead, they're getting these ice beverages. It's more like pumpkin pie spice. It's still just... Pumpkin pie spice latte. Hey, I've never seen them out in the water like that. I should start using some of the fancy tiles. I like the out the exterior of this. I messed up the interior. You feel like all those weirdly named coffees are overhyped as fuck here. Yeah. None of the ones you tasted were world shattering. I feel the same way. You like mocha because it's like hot chocolate, but you might as well order hot chocolate. Well, I mean, you still got the caffeine here. My rule of coffee is just, well, less is more. And it's if you're to the point where you're adding six different ingredients to your coffee, it's like you're just trying to mask out what coffee tastes like. So you probably don't really like it. If you're going to that extent, you know? If I'm getting coffee, or just that sort of thing, it's... You define how sweet you want it, or how hot you want it, that's fine. And then after that is like one other thing to enhance its flavor, and that's it. So mocha is fine, because that's just chocolate powder or chocolate, that's fine. And no syrups, because that's just like... That's concentrated. Hey, I don't want this to take taste like coffee. But uh, you like adding syrup, so mixing coffee with chai. Dirty chai has, has become pretty common here. Dirty chai is pretty good. Yeah, it's like you're adding dirt into the chai. Um, who's out here? Maybe the wolf? I guess we'll see what the themes- Whoa, those are some eyes. I guess we'll see what the themes are. Yeah, you mix tea and coffee, yeah. It's pretty good, should try it. Hey, let's go. I want these. For the uh, place where the band is playing. I need more lights, so sure. Yeah, just ask for a dirty chai. Oh, we're up to the restaurant. We're set to build out two facilities, thanks, in part to all your great work. Restaurant and the cafe. Um, I feel like I should go for the cafe, because the cafe is more likely to give me drinks, right, as recipes. I'm gonna go for the cafe. The restaurant gives recipe. What does the cafe give? 
What are the cafe? What does the cafe give? Here we are. Kilo Cafe will be here and look at the potential water. You, I could do both. It's like it's fine. Enough daydreaming. We need to actually build it. We can start on the exterior design while Nico and Ward will focus on setting up beachfront dining area. I just built it this morning. I think they both give it. How's it going, Colin? Colin, do you have eggnog? We were talking about eggnog before. I think the name just sounds so unappealing. <laughs> I don't know. It's just drinking something that has the word egg in it. It just... I understand what it is. I know what it is. I know what it actually is. Black eggnog with nutmeg. Okay. Too blue? I don't know. Might just go with that. The exterior doesn't matter too much. Sometimes you put eggnog in your coffee instead of milk and sugar. Well, that just sounds way over the top. <laughs> what does it become? What consistency does it become? Okay. Oh, we got the lighting thing. Change both the color and the intensity of the lighting. Can we change the size of the room? Oh no, yeah, okay. I mean, I don't go... Well, it's blue, right? That's the thing, I don't want anything that varies too much. I think I'm just going to go with that. Uh, because natural light changes it. Interesting. Okay, let me get my... <laughs> Chai equals tea, what flavor tea is it? Um, I think typically here... Uh, hang on. I forgot what tea it is. There's like a... There's a stand that people usually go with. Like, it's usually a tea that has cardamom in it. But there's a name for it. There's an alternative name, I forget what it is. It's okay. Cardamom. Um, okay. Sorry, I need to get my time. So... 15 minutes is usually what I go with as a time restriction. So I'll do that. Okay. Let's go. See. I'm gonna try and be as quick as possible with this. Okay, seating first priority. Should hopefully be enough. I don't want to overdo it. Uh, 
Where is Counter? I don't think. Oh, there. No, wait. I don't have Counter here. I have Dining Counter. Watch. Okay. I guess. Need to leave enough room up the back to be able to have staff there. Oh, there it is. Oh. It's fine. We'll do that. That'll work. Um, housewares. Now we need to get all the coffee stuff. Yeah, I'm not sure if there are places that have eggnog for sale here. Well, it's... Okay, I mean, I've never known it to be a thing. But that could be just because of... Growing up, um... Like, most of my friends were... I guess immigrants from other countries other than Australia and not British, that sort of thing. Supermarkets don't sell it, not that I've seen. I haven't been actively looking for it, mind you, but I don't think so. Next time I go have a look. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I, I guess. I, 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 I said this earlier. I'm just hesitant to try it just because it's it's just a name. It puts me off. I just told um, chat about the drink that they have in some Southeast Asian countries where it's avocado smoothie. And it's basically avocado, condensed milk, and then chocolate syrup. And that's just something I'm sure is nice, but I just can't bring myself to try it because it's just, well... The idea of that... To me, avocado has always been uh, used like a mayonnaise substitute for the things that I've eaten. And... But yeah, it's, it's a bit of a stretch to want to try it, you know? There's definitely a mental barrier there. That sounds gross. Yeah, that's the connection you're making with avocado. Like, I got the same thing. Where's the fridge? There we go, you need a fridge. Wait, they do canned eggnog? See, that just sounds even less appealing. <laughs> just, again, because it's just like... Because the word egg is there. It's just... I'm thinking canned eggs, and then you drink them. It's just like, what? No. Stop. Do they have like a whole? They don't have a whole cake. Ah, ha 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 ha. Can I can I put umbrellas? Hang on. Oh. Yes. Okay, I can do this. Okay, and then. Oh man, nice. Very nice. Very, very nice. That worked. Okay, let's get...
You're the only one in your family who likes it, or the canned eggnog. What the fuck? That was weird, my d-pad just went- No, it's still doing it. What? Okay, my controller's acting up. Hold on, I'm pausing the time. What the f- <sighs> Don't tell me this is like a, yet another Nintendo controller that's fucking up. Hold on. Sorry, chat. Seems to be normal now. I don't know what that was. Okay, restarting the timer. As in continuing it, not starting it again. There's no such thing as drift on Nintendo controllers. It's not a widespread issue. Why are you trying to start a lawsuit with us, huh? Try and keep this relatively simple. Oh yeah, this. Definitely want this. Um, but then also lighting. Let's go with these. Fluorescent light for the kitchen. It would suck to uh, work in this kitchen. Just everything is up so high. <laughs> it's a must. Whenever I don't have an idea for a wall. This is like a very cheap and easy way to get a wall looking okay. Ugh, I keep swapping, hang on. Um... Now we can... Unfortunately, I can't really download custom art otherwise. Yeah. 
I wish this game had more patterns you could use. have a simplified version of eggnog based on the same thing and there's apparently Paul's eggnog that's available in Australia. I know Paul's. They make uh, flavored drinks so it doesn't surprise me. Particularly milk drinks. I mean, yeah, I'll, <laughs> next time I'll at the store, I'll keep an eye open. This is, this is another one of those things that this is just like... It's like the Starbucks thing. But if I'm gonna do that, people need to either try berry bread or like... I'm not gonna say try Vegemite, but... Something Australian. Like, if I'm trying that, try something Australian. Don't forget the nutmeg. Nutmeg? Oh, man. That's... That's a whole thing. The thing is, if I get nutmeg, you know, I'll use it for this thing once. Oh, what the hell am I gonna use the rest of it for? I'll have this just... This... I don't know container of nutmeg that's just like, okay. It'd be fine if I had a use for the nutmeg after the fact. That's all you use it for, just specifically for, uh, I think we're done here to be honest. This was never going to be something complicated. Okay, there is one more thing I can do. need a... Do they have a jukebox? Just a form fact, a small form fact, the music player, that's all. I mm, don't really have one. I guess I could... This is fine to put here, I think. That'll do. Just in time. Alright. Well, that's my cafe. I think it's fine. It does the job. It's not... It's not like the Gordon Ramsay restaurant that I did la uh, last year. A couple years. Jeez. Do you know a scary thing someone told me was like... Just think about the year 2019 and how long you feel ago. How long you feel that was ago. I, that was not a sentence, but you get what I mean. Like, how long do you think that was? How far back into the past, and it's just like, waiting for 2020, waiting for 2020, <laughs> that was, 
That was like four years ago, man. Didn't even know me back then. You started watching in 2020. That wasn't too far away. Yeah, they look like staff. That would run a cafe, I think. Well, like Corona France. It it is it is a thing. Yeah, man, time flies. I got it. No syrup here. Other island visitors here. Okay, admittedly, and now it looks like a hat. It looks stupid, but <laughs> the camera angle is fine. Like that's fine. They um, they put cakes on top of a mannequin for some reason. That was definitely the concept of, like, relationships that happened because of the pandemic. And now there's even a term for relationships being rushed because people want to move in with one another to save money. Because of the whole inflation thing. But you know, we're, we're the entitled ones. As always. It'll be easy to do a thumbnail with this later. Alright, that'll do. We're so spoiled right in a sickening, yeah. Oh, this is the outdoor dining area. It's like it's what it's one liter. It comes in, it only comes in a liter, so I can't even get like a small amount of eggnog. Wait, but so the way that this is described is it's described as creamy, smooth flavored milk. Ingredients, milk, skim milk, sugar, milk solids, whole egg powder, flavor stabilizes color. Huh. I guess that's like a custard. Just have a sip at a party, but no one gets it. <laughs> I don't know anyone that drinks it. 
Chris Christmas party as well. It's just. <laughs> I just wanted to see what it was marketed as here. Fun oh wait. Right. Nice. Don't worry, I haven't forgotten you too. Nick and Will will have a nice bonus for all your work on the beachfront dining area. Thank you for all your hard work. Ah, I'm just so pleased to get another business off the ground. Everyone looks so happy. It was a great reminder about why we do what we do. Bring a smile to someone's face is everything. I'm so glad we all got to experience that together. These are tears of joy, everyone. Pure joy. Oh, I almost forgot. Now that we're done with the cafe, we can build a restaurant at any time. I'm hoping we can collaborate again. But there's no rush. Just let me know. I mean, as if we keep building our vacation home business, maybe even more opportunities will arise. I'm so... Oh, it's so exciting. Our vision for this paradise is really coming to life. Yeah, I mean... Alita. I'd have to... I mean, I guess the only way to make it something... Are they all right? Wait, they have a rum eggnog as well? They already have one that's pre-mixed. <laughs> they have rum eggnog already made. And then they have... They, there's three kinds of it. There's like normal, there's Christmas, and there's rum. Okay, I guess there's, like, more eggnog than I thought there was here. What if I tried it for, like, the... Because I'm going to be playing an old game. It's tradition here. It's... I play a game from childhood during the Christmas break. What if I tried it then? Because then there's no work and it's just like, well. You'll make up, you'll make some, all right. I think I'm done for now. I'm gonna go into the cafe and see if they give anything. If it's like before Christmas. Oh yeah, no, it'll be the week I have off, which will be not next week, the week after at some point. So not the week of Christmas, the week before Christmas. Wait, this is school. Hello, yes, I'll have some eggnog. Sir, this is a school. Welcome to the greatest cafe around. No syrup here. Excellent statement. Oh, yeah! Nice! Hell yeah! Give me a few of these. I'm taking these back to the island. Oh no, I'm glad I got this. The alcohol one that you get has brandy, whiskey, and rum. Well, I guess for me it depends, like, what time of... what time I'd be doing it. Because... You know, I can't imagine it'd be the greatest thing to say have that at 10 o'clock in the morning. 
but then, you know, conversely, it's the same thing. It's like, if I'm streaming at night time, it means it's generally morning for afternoon for most people. If this is something that I plan to do, it has to... It's going to be something that is most likely going to occur in the morning my time. It's Christmas, can do whatever I want. I guess, it's just... I don't know, it's just... They'd feel a little odd. I guess if it's kept within reason, it wouldn't feel too bad. It's one drink. Well, it wouldn't be one drink because I'm uh, the minimum buy-in is a liter. <laughs> I mean, I could make a liter one drink. Sure, I could just have the the bottle right there, like as a liter bottle, and just keep drinking. But you know, I have a liter to get through. I'm not gonna have like you know a hundred mils on it and then be like, all right, the rest of it goes down the drain. Unless I absolutely truly hate it. Can I dupe one of my brothers to try it with me? No. I doubt it. They wouldn't be on, on their Christmas break anyway yet. I wonder if they get different menu items each day, but I'm getting as many of these as I can. This is good. They're pokey, so it's okay. <laughs> Invite Lola over for Christmas, but he'd drink eggnog. I'm sure he would. Just depends how busy he is. But we easy to play games if it's during the day. It's just... It would have to be in the morning, because at least that way it's night time for Europeans and it's later in the day for Americans, otherwise it's like the other way around, and that's... A bit expensive for a Christmas trip. I mean, I just meant like in general over Discord. He'd do it. to the thing where I watch Jingle all the way and just watch that on Discord and have eggnog. Eggnog and cookies. Put that cookie down! Now! I'm not gonna make the eggnog. I'm just gonna buy it out of that that bottle. There's no way I would make it. I don't have the, uh... Well, both the room, but also the ability to, like, be able to do cooking stuff. It's just... Tiny apartment, you know? Limited space. You gonna make yours? Yeah, make it. It will probably taste way better than what I have. Um, hang on. Upstairs. Yeah, nice. Nice. These go... ...very well here. It's not rocket science. No, but... I think if I have it in a manufactured form... Then at least I, that's the best chance it can get to be something I can enjoy. It's like, well, then... The merit of his taste is better. Whereas in if I make it and I don't like it, there's always the chance of like, well, maybe I didn't like it because I didn't make it correctly, you know? At least with this, it feels more definitive. 
it's like, well, this was manufactured, and whilst I'm sure homemade is better, it just wasn't for me. I can say that. There's no doubt, you know? The drinks look good. Don't forget the nutmeg. I will try to find the smaller skewness of nutmeg that I can purchase. Isn't nutmeg one of those things that if you have too much of it, it's toxic? Can use cinnamon too. Cinnamon would feel more at home. Hell yeah, look at that. Perfect. I'm glad I got the ca- I went, I'm glad I went with the cafe now. <laughs> Too much nutmeg can make you sick, okay. Keep it in mind. I only push it, put a dash in the drink. Yeah. So I would aim to buy the smallest unit possible. <laughs> just then I'm just stuck with this nutmeg. I'll figure out a day for it. I should probably ask on Discord when people would wanna. If I was to either a go with stream. Or B, go with movie off stream. Oh wait, why did I come up here? But it is tradition, the... Uh... Having to watch Jingle all the way every year. I mean, I don't have to, but I, I mean, I feel like I must. Hang on, what am I doing? That. That button. As much as I like this one, too hectic. I reckon that. Ah, there we go. Even though the menu has sandwiches, <laughs> it's fine. So I'll... I don't know the exact day. I'll have to... Oh wait, the PA speaker, that's why I went upstairs. Um... I'm thinking maybe the Monday, because then that's Sunday for most people. It'd be Sunday evening for Europeans and Sunday late afternoon for Americans. That's what I'm thinking. Um... Hold on. Ugh, time zones are such a pain in the ass. <laughs> It would be the first day of my break officially, right? So that would be the 18th for me, but the 17th for others. 
17th turning into the 18th, or just the 17th. I could do the I could do the countdown thing. There's like the auto time conversion. I'll ask. But it'll either be I do the Christmas game and try the eggnog thing, or I watch Jingle all the way. I guess we'll see. Why not both? Well, yeah, I'm down for both. Depends. Put these behind here. Makes more the most sense. And then I just buy another one. I need to get more of those. This room is looking good. You already forgot what was the 17th year. It would be the 17th year. It would be like whatever the time is now minus three ish hours. Depending what time I get up. I could make the effort and get up earlier, a lot earlier. I'll try, but. It's first day of break. It's tempting to just sleep. <laughs> I'll try to get up sooner. <sighs> Alright. Cool. That was good. Just a bunch of stuff that I wanted, so... Alright. So yesterday I got a bunch of things. I'm now gonna go try an action. Set reminder and make eggnog. <laughs> Alright. I'll talk about it again next week, and then, um, you know. For now, those are the tentative plans. Doing the wrong thing. <laughs> there, that. This is an idea I have. I'm not sure how good it's gonna look. It just depends how much room I have. We shall see. Whoops. I'll fix it later. these things that I hope the picture in my head turns out the way I want it to.
You could argue that this top piece I could abandon if I wanted to and just not use it and probably get away with it. And then that would free up two more slots, but I don't know. You did egg and tree in <laughs> calendar. <laughs> uh... As long as you remember what that meant. Or Christmas tree. It's the same kind of tree. Okay. Oh, cool. It's actually not as big as I thought it would be. Might work. That's nice. Okay. Now, one on either side, and then point. This is gonna take a while, by the way. I thought these would have been much bigger, but this might actually work. Okay. I'm just gonna ignore the fact that it says kid's tent. This is not a kid's tent. This is a premium experience. A premium beach experience. That you buy a ticket to go to a music festival to give the VIP treatment, you know, and you're certainly not thrown on an island and all thrown in a single tent and then given gas station sandwiches. Oddly specific. I'm referencing that, uh, Fire Festival debacle. <laughs> hey, Mania, how's it going? That's, that's a cabana, that's like the correct term. Not that. Uh, I'll see if I can fit it. We need, we need one like this, I think. It's just to add more flair to, like, this camping district that I'm making, you know? I think it'll just perfectly fit in all of them.
I did the wrong thing. Ah! Oh. I guess I did use the other one. Oh well. Is it too late? Uh, I guess it's not too late to change. I think the white wood might look better. Okay, hang on. I got the gist of it though. Yeah. Wait, is it gonna fit? I don't think it's gonna fit. I think that top one is one off. I guess if I shift them, shift them down by one, it'll fit. Okay, I'll shift it down by one. No biggie. going with this. ends. I can always get rid of one if I feel like it's too crowded. Whoops. Why? <laughs> they always... They always have to go near when I'm building something. I kind of wanted it to align with, with these, but I can let it go. Just to be able to fit one more in. too much, I don't think. Okay. 
Okay. Back in a minute. actually done quite a bit today. We'll just get a mix of stuff. I hope I can plant them where I think I can plant them. I'll otherwise plan B. Does work. Nice. Yeah, this is gonna be a case of random is random, so. Do the pancake thing. How about this? If you want pancakes, you can have them with the eggnog thing. It's easier to organize one thing than two. I think that's it. I mean, I guess if I want to put them on the other side, I might just. There we go. One. Am I gonna have some? Uh, they have the mix still. I could. I'm getting up in the morning. It would work. See how that looks. I'm debating on doing yeah, maybe this. Like pushing them up by one. And then they have like a little. I can place something here. I might put a light source there. What am I gonna make for Christmas? Make for Christmas? As in food? Uh, I mean, I think we settled on just having chicken and barbecued meats and then just a bunch of salads and rice and stuff. Baked potatoes, that sort of thing. It's more of a summertime meal. So, no turkey. 
I don't think anyone can be bothered with turkey. It's just... I'd rather the chicken either way. Do seafood Christmas Eve. Seafood is nice. It's a pretty common staple here. I think I need to buy more lights. I'll get some fencing. Actually use this fencing. Ham on Christmas Day. We used to do ham for Christmas. Uh, my dad used to get a ham in a Christmas hamper from work and... We just ham for the next month or so, get frozen up and then we'd have it with sandwiches and stuff for a while. But that ended a long time ago. Ham when done right is good. Lamb is also a big thing here, so doing a, a leg of lamb is pretty good. these ones. These ones are nice. I'll... I need four of them. I might just get the five. Just... Why not? Pasta, right? Yeah. No? Okay. That would have been five. There we go. I don't have the chair that's like more soft, but I guess I can go with these. It'll work. pancakes if you want. Like, I still have the mix. I'm assuming it hasn't expired. I don't think it has. And it's just like, well, it's easy. It's probably pair well, to be honest. Can't be asked to make them. <laughs> but you can make eggnog. Is Wouldn't eggnog be more high effort than pancake? Like, pancake is just, you get a mix. You add water and then bam, done.
<laughs> I feel like both are equal. I guess you have to cook. That's the difference. There's like one extra step. That's, that's the one. Well, that four, but I can probably swap the saving card. Always outsource the frying. <laughs> they got pre made fluff in stuff. Well, well, pre made aren't bad. That'd be a way to go. So it's effectively like buying cake. Spell. Does that like mean thin? Thinner? Nah, okay. I mean, I wanted to put these here, but I don't know. Definite, definite, also known as lap, lapa. Norwegian base cake. Size and texture, they may bear resemblance to pancakes. Huh. Well. Sounds good enough. This feels more like it should be here. I forgot to customize, hold on. First one. Second one. Trying to vary it up. And the law. 
last one. That'll do. I just gotta get it right. Oh, this is annoying. I miss just being able to place things down like on Happiest Home. It's not quite the same blue. And then I'm going to put the light here. The light here. Right there. Yeah. And then I guess a little individual item here. That's like one by one. And that should do. Because up here there was going to be a camping spot and I was going to put like a communal camping, camp, camping campfire, campfire. So this just adds to that. It's just, well, there's also beach camping. I think it works. Just ignore the fact that those items are called tin, uh, kids tents. I'll see what items I have that are one by one that I could place along there. I could probably get rid of this construction thing now. balloon I decided to play this in the morning so then I can dedicate more time to Yakuza later. I want to get further into the story.
Okay. Well, let's take a look what I have. Things that could go out there as part of like that whole design. <laughs> really don't have a lot, huh? You know what? Potentially, someone could be having... I'll customize the color, but yeah, that could work. Someone's making shaved ice, uh, maybe. These can be customized, I can fill them with something. I'll see what I can do. Um... I guess most of the stuff I've been using. I don't even have the magazine rack. I guess I can do a stool and just put uh, that drink on it. That's an easy one. That's just a label, it's not the actual contents. Uh, sure, I'll go with that one. There's so many things I want, but it's just this limit of only being able to buy five things per day. Syrup, pasta, salt. No, I don't know. None of these would really look like they'd just be sitting there. I think I might wait and order the magazine rack.
There's no rush. I just thought maybe I could do something with that. the stall. There it is. There we go. I think I can even stall, hang on, because it's four, so I can even place one above it. There's still room for one more item here. It's kind of neat. Okay, this is pretty cool. Because I can give them one, another one by one here. And then there's still room for them to enter the tent. Yeah, I mean, for now. That's a start. I'll get more items. I might, ooh, I could get a little bookshelf here. That'll work. Oh, one of them could have a bookshelf. I guess this one already has a drink. Maybe like a magazine rack. I don't know. I'll figure it out. There is a lifeguard on duty here. I think once it has the the straight lights, it'll look good. Not that it doesn't already, but. I don't think I have actually found the magazine rack, huh? having a second look. Thank you. 
That's a fancy bed. Okay, I do have this. A smoker. Smoking some meats at the beach. That one's not a bad idea. That could work. Don't really see anything else that stands out right now. Just thinking which one I should place it with. Go with that one. Did I just hear the sound of fleas again? No, I think it may have been the snail. One villager has had fleas every day for the past four days. One can do this. Hey! Each of them doing something unique. I mean, the amount you can put in a 4x4 four four area. Saying that I'm happy with it. Plant flowers, sell fruit. I guess I could sell fruit. That one, I have coconuts that I got. remember to do the KK concept later myself.
Yeah, sure. thinking that I can hop across the river, <laughs> even though that was a long time ago. Oh, there's like a pet hamster. Maybe someone took their pet hamster on vacation. I could put that as a placeholder for now. It's the right color. I think it's made out of softwood, the table that I'm thinking of. Do I not have that table? Ah, that's the one wooden mini table. It's just normal wood. Well, I'm back to the whole thing where I'm running out of normal wood again. I have no hardwood. I'd say this one done. One by one table and just place it on top. There we go. 
For now. I can always put other stuff on that table. But that's the gist of it. It's once the light is there. It's a lot of detail for just this small of an area, but I like it. And every single one will get the same treatment. Suppose the only negative thing about it is the technically not usable, like you can't actually lie down on it. Like, okay, I can course correct to make it functional in one way. There is a way I can fix this. And that's just lifting this. And then you can pop in from the side, and it works. Alright, now it's actually functional. Now it doesn't matter what happens, it's, you can use this no matter what. One more shrub just to finish that up. Oh, wait, I already got one more. Oh, well, this just worked perfectly then. Hang on, I noticed that one's the same. I think this will look nice once it's fully functional. I mean, right now the rain is kind of ruining it, <laughs> but it'll look good once it's not raining. It'd be even nicer if I could place the gyroid on on this, but I don't think you can. Like, I've tested it. It has to be a a stool-like object. I could put him in front of the tent, but nah. I think it's fine.
I don't think it's gonna make that much of a difference color-wise. I think having that one is fine. <laughs> I gotta watch them. balloon. No, it doesn't matter. sell the recipe. done what I want to do for today. Let me just catch the shark. <laughs> we'll hopefully catch the shark. It's not a real shark. Alright, well. I'm pretty happy with this. Just one more thing I gotta get more items for, it's fine. But yesterday when the tents were in the store, that, that was the idea I had in my head. I was like, alright, well. Down the side there, do like a sort of cabana type thing. It worked. But they just need a couple more items to finish it off. Just gotta add the lights from whatever arrives tomorrow. And then just, yeah. Hopefully I can get like a mega magazine rack or something. I don't know. We'll get there. Anyway, if you're watching this later on YouTube, thanks for sticking around to the end and hope you enjoyed today. But, uh, appreciate you all hanging out. Uh, yeah, if you want to support the channel on YouTube, easiest way to do so is just click the like button it does help out a lot so i do appreciate those that do do that it really does mean a lot or you can also watch me play other stuff if you want to click one of the other videos that may have popped up on your screen by now but yeah we'll do this some other time see ya youtube